Hello Aries. Finally, I'm going to do the rest of the monthly uh, readings. <laughs> yeah. And today my hair is uh, autumn-like. So, this is, ooh, new moon, trans, trans mood, transformation. <laughs> Remember that this is general, take what resonates, leave the rest. Don't make the story fit. Um, some of you guys might need to let go of shadow work or shadow thought or people who are bad influence. So how this works? Oh my god, it just keeps coming here. How this works is that this is a month from the day that you see this. This is also going to be predictions. And I am going to give you guys four numbers that is going to be on the screen now. So you can take those numbers. Google them. See what they mean. Maybe there's a message for you. Remember to pay attention to the numbers the next month. So they might be signs for you. I think that's all that I needed to say. Hello! Ace of Cups. And the lovely... Twin Flame card. I can't speak today. I am soon done shuffling. So this is going to be interesting. What is going to come for you guys? Aries. You guys know I have my North Node in Aries, so <laughs> yeah, I don't like when people tell me what to do. I like to be my own boss. Yeah, It's like I have a, fr a friend of mine, she's, she's my best friend, and I spoke with her over the phone, <laughs> and <laughs> she was like, Sandra, you are my twin flame. And I was like, mm, we are friends, okay. <laughs> My twin flame is still out there. <laughs> so, um, sometimes when people, you know, <laughs> try to put me in a box, I'm like, no. <laughs> Whoa, okay. Well, the blessing card just fell out. Let's see. This is going to be cards for your person, for you, and the situation. And I know some of you guys are not on, you know, love search. You don't want to know about someone. But sometimes the whole entire reading can be about you. So, okay. Sometimes I have more than just one message. Your person, whoever you are, whoa, whoever you are dealing with has the mask. It was reversed. You have the stormy. Also reversed. The situation have the friends. Maybe, well, talking about friends, maybe you have a fallout with a friend. And, uh, you know, you guys are going to uh, be uh, best buddies again. BFFs. Let's see what else for Aries. Yeah. Uh, I mean... Both of you guys might be stopping. They have the hanged man, you have the queen of wands. You are yourself. Ooh! Okay, I don't know why I took a card because that was not the meaning, but okay, I did it so you are all going to get one more card from this deck. They also have the six of wands together with the hanged man. You have the Queen of Wands together with the reversed Six of Wands. Swords. Sorry. Huh? The situation is Eight of Wands together with the Lovers. There might be delays in... Um... Wow! Well, some of you guys are fighting with someone. Who are you fighting with, Eris? The last card, the last card, 
Okay, 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 okay. Um, I have to think now. Because the observe landed on your stormy card. And there's a reason for that. You need to be better at observing. Why things happened in the past. They have the sacral chakra. For the future, you have to simplify love. Observe, simplify love, Aries. Teach. This might be a teaching, like whatever you guys are going through, it's been a teaching process. At the bottom of the deck, we do have the Two of Cups. Let's see what we have here. Medicine Man Eye. Healing in its highest form. I do want to take more cards. Should we take an energy card for you guys? Someone out there, yeah! Yeah! Okay, give me an energy card for Aries. Uh, all in all, energy card. Deep knowing! It just keeps coming now. Whoa! Journey and sudden wealth. Number 10 and number 11. <sighs> there might have been some fighting in the past, but you guys are trying to work it out. Some of you guys are trying to work it out. Some of you guys are dealing with someone who is famous and some others of you, someone who is in the public eye. And for third parts of you, it just might be someone that you know who wants to, you know, make it official with you, but who is really stuck in the how. But <sighs> some of you guys are really dealing with someone famous. And or someone who is in the public eye. I want to know who. Um, some of you guys can be water watching for fire. That is the major thing here. I will say, but obviously it can. It doesn't have to be, but. It might be very significant for someone out there that water dealing with fire, or fire dealing with water. In the past, for your person with the mask card, they might have been hiding a lot of things from you. Or they try to hide you. Especially when you've been dealing with someone in the public eye. Someone famous. Maybe someone who was in a relationship. And they you know, it was like they pushed you away when it came to the bigger picture. Like, oh, you can go to this event because someone's going to see you. Or you can go to that restaurant because people are going to see you. It has that kind of sneaky um, energy around it uh, with the mask card. Now that it's reversed, I do feel that they acted upon that, but they didn't want to. But it has something to do with someone out there being famous or being in the public eye maybe a polit politic person oh. I mean it can be whoever public eye famous person movie star TV star YouTuber maybe someone with purple hair for others of you it can also just be that you guys had a big fight a big fallout also because, again, you have the Stormy card. You also have it reversed, so I do feel that it's like you guys didn't actually want things to went down as they went down. You're both sorry for whatever happened in the past. And with the mask card, some of you guys might also be dealing with people who are, again, they are hiding something from you. It can be that they are unsecure about themselves. Maybe some of them have 
has money problems. That's a big thing with guys. If they have money problems, they, you know, I mean, I guess it's the both if it's a woman or if it's a man. But it's really something that's blocking big time, I will say. And now that the big theme here is the deep knowing, this is all about using your intuition um throughout this also because i do feel that now that we have the cheat card that this situation is here to shift your paradigm but also your person's paradigm this might be a twin flame connection i will try to take cards for that after but this is all about inner knowing deep knowing intuition and shifting the paradigm shifting the old so something new can come Pluto, like we talked about, it's really a big thing now. And now that they have the hanged man together with the six of wands, they want victory with you, but they are trapped. Again, it fits perfectly together with the mask card because it really might be someone who's famous and they are trapped because of that. Like, for some reason, they are trapped. Are very insecure about that. They want to move forward. I mean, he's facing, you know, into the future. But again, they have the sacral chakra reversed. And the sacral chakra is all about I want, I desire. It's all about the emotions. I mean, it's so perfect. Also, with the colors, they want victory with you, they want to be with you, but they are trapped in the here and now. And now that the sacred chakra is reversed in the future, I do feel that there's, I mean, I don't feel it. I know that there's a lot of delays in this. But I do feel that, again, it is because that you both need to go on the journey, shift the paradigm, because we do have the journey card here. We have the sudden wealth. I mean, I do feel that if you guys get together you're going to be able to really put out good things like becoming a millionaire like make money with whatever if this is a youtuber then you both are going to make money with doing videos or if it's a po political person like maybe you are this person's you know muse like you're going to create you're going to inspire them in some way there's going to be a lot of, a lot of, a lot of wealth in this relationship when you guys are ready. I mean, simplify love, teach all about simplifying the way that you think about love. Some of you guys might be air signs too, dealing with air signs. But they do lack direction at the moment. They do. They want to. They really, really want to. They know that you are their desire, but they, know, they don't know how to put it out or how to make it work. It's all about teaching. I mean, hello, you have the, 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 you have the lovers, but it is delayed. You guys need to, to come together as friends or, I don't know, there's... Hmm. Allow this to unfold naturally. Now that you have the stormy card together with the observe, I mean, you have been very, very patient with this person. Also because your stormy card was reversed, so yes, there was a fight, but it feels like you understood why and you became very patient. And I do feel that you surrendered to it like okay well this is how it is that's how things work but i do also feel that you waiting so long on this person made you reconsider you might not have been like throwing this person out completely but you reconsidered like you kept your options open like is this person ever going to do anything because it is in the past. The observed card is in the past. But I do feel that in the past something happened where you got some kind of understanding. Like you understood the person's position. 
like, I don't know, again, if this is a famous guy or someone in the public or maybe you understood that they needed to clear out something. Maybe they need to get a divorce. Maybe they needed to straighten out things in their life. You, you did reconsider, but you did also end up understanding why things went down like they did. Again, you have the deep knowing here. It's the big theme in this reading. Now that you have the Queen of Wands for the here and now, again, you might be a fire sign or they just see you as very energetic. You are energetic, very passionate. They see you as someone who's very funny, like they, you make them laugh. Uh, it might also be here because you are more optimistic about the situation. Again, you still have the observed card from the past. So it can be the distant past. It doesn't have to be like a year ago. But from whatever, whenever the fight happened and up till now, you got some kind of understanding. And in the here and now, you might be more optimistic. And it might be because that they might have, you know reached out to you again, started the conversation again, that you got some kind of hope. But you also do have the six of wands reversed, which is delays, lack of process. So <clears throat> it is a little bit like on one hand, you are optimistic about it, but you don't see any process. And they, I mean, they are not moving because they want to, but they are still trapped in whatever they are in whatever they do. But you are, again, you are optimistic and you are standing your ground. If this didn't happen already, there will be some kind of cancellation in travel with this person. Because this is in the here and now. And the Six of Swords is all about cancelled trips. It's also all about accidents in water. But I don't feel that's the case here, but you never know. But there is a cancellation of a trip. It can also just be that this is delayed, because again, delayed. They might have reached out to you and said that they wanted to take you somewhere, but then something got in the way. Again, they got trapped. Maybe they are really famous and they are just working so much and they can't find time to uh, to be in a relationship like they want to, but they can't find time to it. You might live in, you know, different kind of cities or different kind of countries. With the future, you do have to simply love. So I do feel that you will be very nostalgic um, in the future. Again, this can be the distant future, but they are still... They are still trapped, um, you are still a desire, they know that you are the one, but they are still trapped. But I do feel that now that this card is in the future, that there will be communication again. And this is also water, so there is, there is a lot of water in this. The sacral chakra is also water. And w if you are dealing with a Scorpio, they are really not the quickest to answer. So that might also be why there is so much delays. When you guys start communicating again, you need to communicate with them from an open, pure heart. No fighting. The fighting is over, and I do feel that you understand that. If you think about the past, there is also the energy that you need to think positive about the past. Think about the positive memories, no matter what memories it is, if it's from your past or if it's from this person. Also with the nostalgic thing that you might have a lot of flashbacks from, I don't know, when you guys saw each other last. This kind of feels like, you know, weeks for me. Like in the next weeks you will have flashbacks and, you know, communication will be opened up. And with the friendship, there will be positive support. And I do feel that now that it's in the past, it is like that you know that you have the positive support. You guys know that you are supporting each other. Like that the fighting is over. It's, it doesn't really feel like there's fighting going on right now. There's a lot of delays, but no fighting. But again, with the reversed, 
Eight of Wands, there's no speed and there's more delays, but the lovers. I mean, this is a passionate relationship. This is real. Abundance. And with the cheat card, the five is all about starting something new. It's all about learning from the past. Like the mistakes that happened in past relationship. Or in the past with this person. In the past with your parents. And I do feel that it's a big paradigm shift for both of you guys. Like, this is going to be a new journey, a new experience. A shift in consciousness. You guys are going to be able to manifest the biggest dreams together. Now that the cheat card is here, someone can also come in and guide you guys. Either this is a friend or this is like, you know, the universe guiding you guys. So, all in all, this is pretty amazing, Aries. I'm just saying. I really do feel that um, some of you guys are dealing with with famous people. Someone in the public eye. YouTuber, TV host, whatever. So, I will take the last cards to see if we can get maybe a timing or maybe a like, what is this person about? Is it a twin flame? Should we see, but we can find out. So I take whatever cards are going to come out from here. What is the message from spirit? Acceptance is the key to inner peace. At times we must accept how things are. There is no point in trying to change that. Not everything is in your control. That's true. You can control uh, all the delays. Can we get a sign? Is this a twin flame journey or is this a soulmate journey? I did a private reading where I got a pretty spot on answer for if it was a twin flame or what it was. Oh shit! I will see the, say that the only card that's face down is the soulmate card. I just talked about that. Your soulmate is already with you in spirit. Believe this and they will manifest physically. Yeah! Doesn't really matter if this is a twin flame or a soulmate, but somewhere from your past. Let's see if we can get a time on this. Any more messages for Aries or maybe a time when this will happen? Give us a time. When will this happen? Get more information. You might have to get some kind of information. Deep knowing, intuition. You might already know when this is going to happen. It can be changes. I mean, I don't think that I'm going to get a time. Nope, be assertive. assertive. Well, there is. Um, I do feel this is fast, I do feel this is weak, but paradigm shift, patience. Something needs to happen here before you guys can be together. I hope you guys could use the messages in this reading. Please let me know in the comments below. Remember to subscribe if you haven't already and remember to like so this message can get out to more people. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!